What's happening? Just on the couch with Stanley Cup winner. What's happening? How's it going, pal? Um, uh, so what's happened in your life in the past week or so? Not Two too weeks. much, actually. Not too much? You know, just uh, just a regular week. You know, won the Stanley Cup, brought it back to Chicago. Yeah. Here's my question, man. And now you're in a perfect position to answer it. Is there any fear of like any kind of lip fungus when everyone's kissing that cup on the ice? I was watching it at home and I thought, and I even tweeted about it. There's someone's gonna get a lip thing. There's a lot of weird stuff I think that's happened with that Stanley Cup just in the past week. And I can't imagine what's happened in so many years previous. So uh, stories I can't really tell on camera right now, but uh, you know, maybe we'll talk about it later. See, well, that was my next question. There must be something because God knows you've heard the legendary stories of some of the crazy shit that's happened with that cup. Is there anything that can be said on the internet, like that can be that can be coded over? Yeah, well, you know, a lot of uh, drinking champagne and. and uh, come on, come the on. Usual stuff. Come on. You know, what, what they tell us to stay away from is just don't drop it and <laughs> don't throw it at the bottom of swimming pools or anything like that or else they take it away from you. So and that's we're it. trying to steer clear of that. Right now. Um, there's a Canadian band called Stars, and they were actually in Chicago playing the night you guys won the cup, and they just said it was insane. And I'm just curious, man, what was it like? Like, did you guys left the dressing room? Did you head out? Like, what was the city like? Well, I, can't, I can't even describe it, you know, Matt. It was, uh, we knew coming home from Philly it was going to be something else, but, you know, we had about 2 million people show up to our, our parade with the cup, and, you know, whether we were going to restaurants or bars or whatever, there's just, I don't know how people knew where we were, but they were just following us around downtown. There'd be thousands of pe people on the streets just in a matter of minutes, and, uh, you know, we knew it was going to be crazy, but that was uh, to a whole new level. You know, you're a young dude, and, and to win a cup so early in your career, are there veterans on the team who are like youngsters getting it already? Are they jealous? Well, I could think of John Madden, uh, who's won a couple, and, and he says, you know, this is probably one of the best teams he's played on. And a guy like Brent Sopel, who has been a lot of conference finals in the past and, and has never won. So uh, even like Marion Hosa, who went, you know, two years, the last two years, went to the cup final, lost both times. So it means a lot to us to pull it off this year. Cool, man. Now let me ask you this question. Do you watch the show Jersey Shore? Yes, I do. I'm actually a big fan. So. Are you? Because yeah. check this out. Have you met Snooki? I haven't met her yet. So. Are we bringing Snooki out? Yeah. Dude, you're going to meet Snooki. She's a little busy right now. There nah, she is. You're going to meet Snooki. Snooki, what's happening? Snooki. How's it going? How are you? Hello. I'm Matt. How are you? Nice How to meet you. you. Have a seat. Well, I gotta be honest, this has to be the first time in the history of the world that a television or internet host has got to sit on the couch with Snooki and a Stanley Cup winner at the same time. <laughs> That's true. Seriously, no one else in the world is doing this right now. situation. Yeah. That is a situation. <laughs> <laughs> Babu! Good one. Snooki, can I offer you a jelly bean? I hate jelly beans. Well, glad I did my research. Oops. <laughs> Good lord. I like gummy bears. You like Come gummy on. bears? Snooki? I got some of those too. Oh, there you, you go. Now, can I ask you a question, Snooki? These John McCain tweets, is this real? Were, these, were you really tweeting with John McCain? I, you know, we had our first 10 minutes on um, MTV Movie Awards. Right after it aired, John McCain tweeted me, and he was like, you know what, I would never text on tanning. And I was like, oh, okay. So now me and John McCain are dudes. Is that, is this true? This is a true story? It's all true, it's all true. I saw it, and I was like, Dad, oh my God. John McCain just tweeted me. So now probably Obama hates me, but I love Obama. She's she's a big deal. I guess. This is Snooky, man. Yeah. What about what about Twitter world? Are you into the tweeting? No, I'm, yeah. I'm not a tweeter, and uh, I used to be on Facebook too, and, and uh, kind of turned that down too. So maybe I'll try it out one of these days. So seems do to be working for GTL? her. Do you do GTL? No. Oh. No. <laughs> yeah. You don't GTL? Yeah, no, I do. Of course, since it's cool now, thanks to you guys. You so. do it? <laughs> Can I feel your muscles? Oh, here it is. Do oh, I, I like qualify? That. Do I qualify? Yeah. I like that. I'm Where are you happy. staying tonight? <laughs> I'll let you know. I'll give you I'll give you a room key. <laughs> Please c continue. Continue this conversation. I just want to watch. How come you didn't ask feel my muscles? Because I'm an internet host? <laughs> nothing wrong Do you with that. GTL? I mean you know, he won a Stanley Cup. Yeah, yeah. Just saying. Give him a feel. He'll feel better after. I'm just saying. Yeah, a little spaghetti. I'm just saying. <laughs> Good Lord. Now, where's Polly D? 
Paul E.D. is actually presenting. That's why he couldn't be here right now. I heard a story that there's a Paul E.D. tanning bed in Las Vegas. There is. Is this true? Paul E.D. just got his tanning bed for his birthday, and he also got a Paul E.D. chopper. Come on. I swear to God. Must be nice. <laughs> <laughs> now, are you a hockey fan, Snooki? Um, you know, I've actually tried to play hockey, and I'm actually pretty good at it, so. Really? I what can see that. She's, yeah, she's I'm got, a good uh, hockey. I like to push people and try and score. Got some skill. <laughs> You're not cheering for the Devils? The Devils. Are you in the New Jersey Devils? I'll be cheering for Philly. Oh, no, I don't like Philly. Good. I'm a Mets fan. You're a Mets fan? Yeah, just saying. Just saying. <laughs> now, what about hockey players? Are you into hockey players? You know what? I just, you know, I was thinking, like, what kind of guy would I really want to go for? Baseball player, they're actually really players. So are basketball players. But hockey players, they're, like, really nice. And they're Good genuine. Guys. Good guys. Oh, yeah, I know that, so... <laughs> Might have to hook up with some hockey players. Why not? See cool. what's going on. Well, listen, we're going to throw back over to Liz. This is Liz, by the way. She's on my we're mug. Oh, hey.